Hello everybody and here we are for our intermarket uh, analysis. Let's start from the euro dollar that as we can see was already involved in this uh, price around 1.218. Uh, the market tried to go below but later the close was over this level. So very interesting and very important level for the uh, euro dollar and also very nice situation for the GB pound and the US dollar because the target we highlighted some weeks ago about 1.42 was reached and now we have a possibility for an additional breakout here if the price will go above here or uh, maybe the price will come back around 1.4 that will be really very interesting too. Let's switch from currencies to commodities and let's start with the gold able to uh, run above 1900 so next from here next price will be next relevant price next relevant resistance will be 1800 965 that is a really strong resistance coming from the past and we can identify support around this level that uh, will mean that uh, uh, we will see very important support from 1800 to 1815 so this is more or less the most interesting support and uh, above we have 1965 as a main resistance let's switch from this uh, uh, let's switch from this uh, uh, gold to the oil the oil is really doing good and again it's uh, 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 let's say it's uh, on the road the attack at uh, the price of uh, $67 that is a very very important resistance that we have on the road so it's really it's really important to see the gold to see sorry the crude oil over this price that uh, the crude oil is unable to reach uh, uh, we have to go back before 2019 so let's say in the last part in the last quarter of 2018 uh, the crude oil was able to stay uh, permanently over this level so it's really it's really important to see if the crude oil will be able because also the oil company will move after that let's switch right now to the uh, stock indices first of all let's assume that uh, the uh, s p 500 was unable to reach the previous historical high here that is around 4230 but uh, the movement is quite good and the previous uh, uh, resistance uh, were uh, already uh, overtaken so it's really interesting to see what is going to happen similar situation we have uh, on the uh, nasdaq but the nasdaq was unable to move over 13700 that is really really strong worked a lot here as a support later worked here two days uh, consecutively as a resistance and now it's four days that this this price is limiting the possibility of the nasdaq to uh, try another attempt to reach the previous historical high so let's see what is going on later and also let's have a look to the european stock indices like the dax unable to reach again the historical uh, previous historical high here but really in a good shape as we can see especially after friday session but the best one in europe is for sure the euro stock 50 able to do a breakout here after some uh, after one week able to move really over this price and able to overtake 4050 uh, it's really important because uh, right now the next resistance will be the historical high around 4600 that we have seen in 2007 so it's really it's really really interesting let's switch right now to some uh, uh, interesting stock let's start with uh, uh, let's start with uh, uh, this interesting one okay so you know i like triangles i like resistances i like breakout so this is very interesting we can clearly see this figure here and if the price will be able to move over this uh, level um, around uh, 45.4 let's say 45.5 we will see probably a very interesting breakout let's move to another one and uh, uh, we have this uh, very interesting one uh, PDC energy that again is in a quite similar situation so we have several attempts to do a breakout of this very interesting level we uh, 
do not see any close over this uh, price of 42.5 so if we will see close uh, above uh, 42.5 dollars this will be very interesting too let's switch to let's switch to another stock that is uh, uh, here we have l e l i l a okay liberty latin america and again we have something like a box here we can clearly see this sideway around this level okay work it as a resistant here seems to be violated as a support but if we uh, draw this line this this is really interesting and uh, what if the price will move over this level around um, 14.5 let's say if we will see prices over uh, let's say if we if we will see prices above this 14.8 let's say or 15 maybe someone could say this could be really really interesting so uh, this is really interesting and uh, this is uh, the style i love for trading because this is really really good um, another good one it's uh, this one that we can see here uh, so news corp uh, this is this is really interesting again because we have here a very nice triangle again that uh, i think the market uh, could move over uh, let's say that uh, we could uh, uh, think that uh, close over 27.64 so let's say if we will see some close around 28 dollar uh, this will be very interesting because uh, this is a real good uh, a real good real good chart uh, i have uh, two others to show you one is uh, this uh, uh, oxtree health again quite similar situation uh, sideway several attempt to move uh, let's say to overtake this price uh, we are around uh, we are around uh, 54.5 so let's say that uh, uh, 64.5 sorry let's say that uh, if we will see close above uh, 65 this will be uh, this will be in breakout and uh, let's say that uh, it's, it's quite important to see that uh, during the last day we have seen the price coming a little bit back and volume increasing so i do not expect it to happen maybe very soon but uh, if the price will be able to move over here i think this will be really really interesting i have a last one to show you that is uh, uh, here we are uh, okay this is a very interesting interesting stock price zero look at what kind of a very incredible effective nice uptrend that we can see here it's really interesting and the price uh, the, it, it, it is always the same story consolidation and then breakout consolidating breakout and again we can see the same story here we have a flag here and then up so consolidating the price we can expect that the signal will be over this level so i think that uh, if we can see any close over 194 let's say is uh, the signal that uh, we can go through so it's really interesting thank you for being here with me this is all for this week see you next time ciao ciao